are in for a treat. It's an evening of jaw-dropping illusions celebrating television's number one magic show. Penn and Teller presents The Foolers, four master magicians who pay homage to the classic magic of Penn and Teller. And it's coming to Clues Memorial Hall this month. And we are so lucky to have one of those performers right here with us on All Indiana. Vinny Grasso joins us now live. Vinny, man, how you doing? I am great. How are you, Alexis? Oh, man, I'm better now. I'm really better because we got to talk about the unforgettable evening that people are going to be able to have with you. I mean, you've spent your whole life pursuing amazement and wonder and making memories. You got to tell us where what we're going to see uh, when you come to perform at Butler. Uh, well, it's it's going to I mean, we're we're working nonstop on it and we're we're super excited about it because it's not any other show that has toured around where some some shows that have toured around they've they've either been just little bits of a whole bunch of different magicians and and or uh uh just uh basically a storyline of 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 one other thing this is uh magicians doing their stuff also combined with homages to Penn and Teller mm. so there are routines that Penn and Teller are famous for and these magicians including myself will will do some of those so it's 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 really unlike anything that has gone on the road before I love this there's so many people who have like never experienced this I know you've experienced it so often because you're out here doing it can you perform an illusion with us now to give them a taste uh, sure sure and uh, again this is what I'm gonna do now is a trick so Everything that I say from this point on is probably BS, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So, uh, what we, we talked we talked a little bit before I got on 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 here. And and from that Alexis, I, I tried to tried to think about what kind of person you were and what kind of life choices you might make. Mm. <laughs> and 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 I I committed to something. Now, because it's a a, a magic show that we're going to do, so we'll 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 make these life choices relevant to a magic show and and people really associate magic shows with with cards, like playing cards, right? Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Um if if you were to choose any card at all that you wanted, that you liked or or anything like that, uh what what would you choose? And and I would just just give one little caveat like I wouldn't choose like an ace of spades or queen of hearts because those are really common mm -hmm, mm -hmm. um I would choose a five of hearts five of hearts mm -hmm. is there any particular reason why you chose the five of hearts mm, I was born on five five uh, you okay. know May 5th and I got a lot of hearts, so I figured, why not hearts? Uh, okay, all right, well, great. So it, it was meaningful, but there was no way I would have been able to look up your age and put all that stuff together, right? No. No. Oh. Are you sure? I mean, maybe. I don't know. I, you know, I know right, we just right met. Right a deck of cards, right? Uh huh. And you, you never told me that beforehand, right? No, no, we never had that conversation. Okay. Uh, if you see the the card, can. I'm not sure how visible this is, is it? Yeah, yeah, I can see you it. See the cards here? Uh-huh. Do you see any cards that look different? Uh, yeah, one, one right there by your by your finger. This one right here? Uh yeah, yeah. What card did you say? I said a five of hearts. Get out of here. <laughs> I need to take you with me to parties. This is crazy. That's <laughs> crazy. How did you do that? I didn't even know I was gonna say five of hearts. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's uh, like I said, it, it's it's a trait, and that's kind of the, the whole Penn and Teller thing. I mean, Penn and Teller. If if I sat here and said, "Oh, it's because I, you know, figured things out with you and all this other stuff or whatever," that is not Penn and Teller, and that is not what we're about. Um, th this was a fun magic trick, and I hope you just had some fun with it. But there's, you know, I, I make a joke in, in, in my, my full evening show, uh, you know, that people want to touch me, you know, like <laughs> as if it'll rub off on, on it. But it's, there's, there's, uh, I mean, we're just, we're doing some fun things uh, for entertainment. And, and uh, you know, uh, of course, I've, I've fooled Penn and Teller a couple times. So I, I have the trophies there. But again, it's for fun. I love this. And you know what, honestly, we need something like this 
in the atmosphere. So much positivity. Penn and Teller presents the Foolers taking the stage Saturday, February 25th at Clues Memorial Hall. You can head to allindiana.tv for ticket information. Vinny Grasso, you are a friend of the show. Come back anytime. Uh, I'd love to, Alexis. Thank you.